This is an Arizona's Family News Update. Good morning, I'm Jamie Serretta. Here are the latest stories we're following from Arizona's Family Newsroom. The US 60 is back open after it was shut down for hours outside of Morristown due to a deadly runway crash. DPS tells us five people were killed in that crash around 10 last night, but westbound lanes of the 60 were closed until earlier this morning. DPS tells us two cars were involved in the crash, but so far the victims have not been identified. Tempe police say they have arrested the man who hit a bicyclist with a truck last night, killing her. Officers tell us Paul Meza Portillo was turning from Mill Avenue onto Baseline Road when he hit the 41 year old woman dragging her several hundred feet. We are told the woman was in a crosswalk and officers say Portillo was aware he was aware of the crash, but admitted to drinking alcohol beforehand. He is now facing second degree murder and hit and run charges. The Arizona Department of Health Services added 706 new cases of COVID-19 to our state's total count, bringing it to more than 840,000 since the pandemic began. They have also reported two more deaths linked to complications of COVID-19, meaning the total number of deaths in Arizona is now just under 17,000. Meanwhile, the state says an estimated 31% of Arizonans have had at least one COVID-19 vaccine dose. More than 2 million Arizonans have at least their first, while more than 1.4 million people are fully vaccinated in our state. Meteorologist Kim Quintero here. Sunny skies today, unseasonably hot. The forecast high 97 degrees. That would tie the record set for this date. Tonight, we dip to a low of 67 degrees. For Sunday, sunshine returns with a high of 99. That would set a new record. Record territory through Monday with highs in the upper 90s. Then a trough is going to bring in some cooler air. That'll help drop our temperatures to the low 90s Tuesday through Friday, but we're still 10 degrees above normal. Lows will drop to the 60s each morning and we'll have breezy winds each afternoon. For updates on more stories we are following, you can download our AZ Family News app and subscribe to our YouTube and Roku channels. I'm Jamie Serretta. Have a great day.